Previously on Red Circles. There's been a development in Newport. What? Oh my god. Bert King. My father died when I was three. My mother drank every day after that. She would disappear for days. I've spent a lot of time trying to completely disassociate myself from the Jackson family. So you were his half-sister? Sophie. Mom. Okay. My okay. water just broke. Ah. Oh my god. Her name is Elizabeth Wood. She disappeared last year. I'm still trying to contact her husband. Where is he? Get this. Last week he sold his house and moved to Chicago. Why? He gave up. He needed a change. And he accepted the fact that she wasn't coming back. And then of course she turns up a week later. <laughs> yeah, right. Well, I guess the good thing is she had a healthy baby girl. She's still sleeping. I'll stay here, you guys all go. See as you should be about done with the O'Brien house by now. Are you gonna be okay? Yeah. Donna. Yes. Don't worry about me. Kane. I can't give you your job back. That's not my decision. Yeah, I know. She's with Arnold's. They went to go see Dr. Warren about two hours ago. What are the plans? Hopefully CSU will find something. I still don't understand how you knew she was in that house. I didn't. I just had a feeling it would be the best place to start. Plus, I couldn't deal with you two fighting anymore. It wasn't getting us anywhere. Hmm. Speaking of fighting, didn't you have something you wanted to tell us? Tell me everything and I'll tell you exactly what's going on. It's been a while. It has. I've been keeping tabs on you, studying up on all your cases. Although lately, not so many. I hope things are looking up for you. It's been a rough six months. I wish I could have been there for you, but, well. Look, I'd love to catch up, Mom, but that's not exactly why I'm here. I thought it a coincidence that on the same day that Harold slut showed up, suddenly my daughter wants to see me. Let me ask you, Sophie, is she a better mother figure for you? I heard you freaked out on her and they had to sedate you. Oh. Or was that another one of your Academy Award winning performances? Oh, well, let's get it all out on the table. We're working on a case. That's it. We need Dad's safe combination and I know you have it. I do. Well, then what is it? <laughs> what? You think I'm going to give it to you just like that? Look, I'm not playing games with you. Finally, I have leverage. I've wanted to talk to you for years, ever since your father died. And ever since I've been in here, you haven't even come, even then. So now that I have you here, I'm going to make you stay as long as I want to. You're sick. I would have thought these last six months would have changed you. Don't think I didn't notice those similarities to the O'Brien case. You have no idea how the Waters case has changed our you family. You have no idea what's going on. I have to go. Give me the combination. No. Give me the combination. No! Mom, I fucking... Language! You are a piece of work. And you're so messed up, I'm glad you're here. Though, it doesn't seem like it's helping much. You're still the most sadistic person I've ever met. I mean, I arrest criminals every day who are as bad as you are. And you think that I'm gonna sit here and associate myself with you? You're not my mother. I lost my mother years ago. I lost her when I found my father's blood all over his office and my mother cooking dinner in the kitchen. So if you think that I'm going to sit here and play these games with you and allow myself to try and listen to you defend yourself to me, not a chance. Not a fucking chance.
never know how your father and I tried to help you! Never! 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 I can't believe this. Is this a joke, Harvey? It's true. We found gray colored hair fibers on the bed, as well as semen. My level of pissed off just rose. We'll let you know when we compare fibers, but I'm pretty sure it's going to turn out positive. Hunter Jackson was sleeping in that bed. I, I can't believe this. He, he was here. Who would have known? This house has been vacant for at least five months. So he kept Elizabeth tied up in the attic while he slept here? Elizabeth wasn't the only one. We found some restraints tied to a pipe in the basement. I'm oh, not more restraints. My son could have been down there. Or Roberts. I can't believe this. He was hiding in plain sight. Okay, everyone, let's just relax. No, no, he could have. He was probably laughing at us. Oh! What I miss, Arnold? Arnold, what are you doing here? I thought you were with Arlington. She's meeting me here. Meeting you? Yeah, she had to leave. Should be here any minute. What's going on? Oh, you don't want to know. What did Dr. Warren say? Dog blood on the body. No human blood. Just like the rest. Died of strangulation about six to eight hours ago. Well, it's six o'clock now. Found the body at twelve, so it must have been six o'clock in the morning. We have the start of our timeline. I just had twelve hours. What about Johnson? Dr. Warren said he died about an hour before we found the body. Which was what time? Found the body at four, so it must have been three o'clock. He must have been watching us. I mean, he was there when you guys found Mary. We have to go back and find out where he was. We'll meet you back at the house. Okay. Why don't you stay here and canvas the rest of the neighborhood? We'll find out if anyone's seen anything. You're back? Yep. How dare you run off like that? I thought you'd understand. I would have come with you. You couldn't. Why didn't you call me? Why didn't you call me? Emma was right. It's happening again. I know. Do you think Hunter Jackson killed Officer I, Johnson? I don't know. Well, then what's going I, I, on? No, I, no one knows anything, okay? I don't even know why Hunter's doing any of this. There's something you need to see. She's reading in the riot act. Oh, yeah. Where am I? You're in the hospital. It's okay, you're safe. I'm the police. I'm Chief Donna Williams. Right. Right. Your daughter's okay. Don't call her that. Okay, okay. We don't have to talk about her. I know this must be hard for you. We can, we can just sit here. We don't have to talk about anything. But we do have reason to believe that somebody else was with you. And we would like to find them. I was hoping... He killed him. What? He wasn't good enough. Who was it? He was trying to save them. Them? He said he put him out of his misery. You aren't making any sense, Elizabeth. He was so young. I want to help you. <laughs> we 
Where's my husband? He'll be here soon. I can't talk about this right now. Can I just... Yes, honey, it's okay. I can wait. Did you get an address from him before he left? He went to Chicago for a job. He had a friend out there. He told me he'd call me once he arrived. Still haven't heard anything. She's still sleeping. What did she say? I don't know. I couldn't understand half of what she was saying. All right, I'll call the realtors who helped sell Daniel's house. Maybe they have an idea. I'll let you know if I hear anything. Okay. Oh, no, forget about it. Then what's wrong? You seem quiet. No, I just... I just want answers, that's all. There's something else. You still haven't told me where you've been all this time. Nowhere. I, I, I hit dead ends everywhere I went, okay? Wait, what do you have to show me? I've been working with Detective Harolds. She and I... What is it? Nothing. Just what do you have to tell me? Ever since you showed up, it's like you can't look at me. Kate! I, I, I'm tired, okay? I just want answers. Now, you please tell me what's going on. I'll show you. Kelsey? I don't know where she is. Here's that file you want from Dr. Warren. Give it to him. What? I guess I could go down the street and interview some more people. Then why are you still standing here? <sighs> Can't you just be nice to one person? Being nice never gets you anywhere. Who told you that? Look, I have my way, you have yours. I don't understand, though, how after all these years of being my partner, you still expect me to be all nice and cuddly with everyone. Why can't you just leave me alone about it? Erica, no. You can yell at everyone else, but not me. Did I ever tell you about my sister? I didn't know you had a sister. Oh. Well, I do. I was bullied a lot when I was younger. I was a pushover, I was too nice, nobody respected me. Finally, one day my sister said, Erica, do you wanna be the nice person that gets no respect or the mean person that gets all the respect? I mean, in school they tell you not to be a bully, but at the end of the day, no one messes with a bully. You respect them because you're scared of them. If you become all nice, you're being taken advantage of, especially in this world. And you know, the last time I was nice and let someone make a decision for me, I ended up getting shot. In this career, you just can't let people take advantage of you. If you do that, you don't have control, and if you don't have control, you're not safe. But you have your ways, I have mine. But nothing you say will change that, ever. So I'm sorry if the way I act makes you angry, but it's the way I am. Accept it and move on.
18 victims. That we know of. Why has no one heard of this? One in each state, small towns. Who would have known? Well, then how did you discover it? My father did. He was working on it with Harold's before he died. Why didn't they... Believe me, I said the same thing. I just can't believe that even now, no one has made any connection. I mean, you have 18 women found in showers, you have 18 children dead. I just can't believe I'm hearing about this now. He did one a year. He was smart. Most of these women have records of child or drug abuse. From the beginning, most of them look like open and shut cases. Uh, but what about the, uh, the shower? Some detectives looked into it, but they thought what we did. And, uh, where are these women now? That's the thing. Eleven of the victims took their own life. Five died in prison, and two are missing. Missing? Just vanished. But what, are, what are these yellow tacks? That's the other thing. The four yellow tacks represent the four officers who died during the case. What? I know. Hello? Hi, is this Gordon from Red Realtors? Yes, this is Jim Gordon. Mr. Gordon, I'm sorry to bother you. My name is Detective Eric from the Newport Police Department. I have a few questions about how you help sell. Yes. The name is Daniel Wood. What would you like to know? Next time on Red Circles. She's dead. I can't choose you.